Good morning. 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 And I'm painting um, some, uh, what's the word, meadow flowers. <laughs> Wani Manly. Sorry, if you hear me gulping, I'm just gulping down my tea before it gets cold. <laughs> right. I'll just wait for a few more people before I start my explanation of what I've got. How is everyone? How are you doing, Manly? How's Ziggy? Okay, I finished my tea. Right. I'm going to start, even though there's not many people here, it is Monday morning. I will forgive them. <laughs> This is uh, A3 watercolour sheets that I'm using and they're from Sea Whites of Brighton. That's all the details there for you to look at. You can see it's always, near enough always the same at the minute because I've got my favourite paper and I've got my favourite brushes and the brushes I'm using, they're not brushes and they are a faux squirrel number 10. And then one close scroll number eight. And they're nice because they've got a nice full, what do you call that, the heel of the brush? Full bodies there. And a nice um, tip. Sorry about my nails. I've forgotten to take my nail varnish off. <laughs> so I've been picking it. And I've still got black fingernail from storm damage. And there's a new one growing underneath, so it's going to come off. And that's really disgusting. <laughs> <clears throat> This morning, this is going to be meadow flowers and things. I might stick a butterfly in as soon as I saw, <laughs> saw it the weekend. Um, I've dug out my Mission Gold palette. So in here, a Mission Gold, set for the ones in the these. These are Van Gogh colours, which are purpley colours. And I'm not sure what this one is on the corner. Oh, it's so like something maroon colour. So they're all like purpley pinks here. And um, yeah, now I've got it all over my fingers. <laughs> I've wetted them all, sprayed them all, so they're all nice and wet and juicy. And um, let's just let's start painting. I'm going to paint some echin echinaceas, echinaceas, echinaceas. Yeah. So I've got my pink palette here, all mixed up. Do you want to see my palette as I paint? <laughs> I'm trying to. Fit in. I know I'm quite far away. I can zoom in if. Um, uh, the people like different things. There's um, people who like to see everything that I'm doing, and then there's people you can see my pajamas. <laughs> yeah, I'm painted in my pajamas. I've got um, what is it? Some poor bunny, <laughs> child's pajamas. Uh, nothing. Um, it's, it's creating shadows. Get away, shadows. I haven't got the big, big um, studio light. I've got my studio lights on, but I haven't got the um, the extra lights, the um, proper studio lights. <laughs> hi, Rosalie. <laughs> Good morning. Come and say hi if you're watching. Don't bite. There's just a few people that have been here around for years. So, yeah, it is years now, isn't it? When I started, this was... Um, I don't know what I'm doing here. Hang on. I've forgotten what I'm painting. <laughs> when I first started doing this, it was um, lockdown, I think. I've lost my bleach. It's sad times. Where's it gone? It's re rolled off the table somewhere. From when I was doing the painting. I haven't painted all weekend. You know, I've been doing some computer stuff. I'm going to, oh, there it is. <laughs> Saved. You know how I like using bleach. <laughs> That's pretty, isn't it? Stick a, a top on it. I'm trying to keep these quite simple. 
I've got lots of green here. This is one of those uh, Viva, Viva, <laughs> Viva colors of sheets that you get. I've got the whole thing somewhere, but I don't like them because I can't. I says they're all right when you um, go um, out sketching, but I don't like having to flip backwards and forwards with them. So I, I pulled the sheets out in the end. I always use really vibrant colours and I'm trying to make them a bit softer. <laughs> it doesn't work. Let's see if I can do a... a I want to see what that colour is here. This mirror, ooh, It's pretty. They always come out really dark. <laughs> um, I use a lot of pigment when I paint. And I wanted to, like, do them a bit softer. Sometimes I can. If I loosen up, I'll just do, like... Softy, softy. All that marine gives a nice um, effect. Green. I have to tell myself what I'm doing. Just <laughs> Morning, Lisa. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Day off. I've had had the yeah I've had the weekend. Well, I haven't really had the weekend off because I've still been doing stuff. I always say I'm going to have some time off, but I still work. It's a problem working for yourself, and that, as Frankish would say, career choices. <laughs> if you stop working, I don't get paid. <clears throat> Oh, thank you, Manny. Yeah, I forgot you've got one. I forget who buys what. I should have a should have a record of my customers. I'm not very business orientated. <laughs> I don't think many artists are. It's like, um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not going to do. Oh, she says I'm not going to do a background on this because <laughs> I'm going to. I'm painting these four fabric designs. As you do. <laughs> so I got a really like this is a this is why I don't wash my palette because you get these colours like this. This is a really nice neutral grey colour. I know it's mainly this, but it's picked up the greens and the blues and everything. And if I try to make that colour, I, I wouldn't be able to. So um yeah. <laughs> And I'm going to use that to um, paint some some little grasses. Try to anyway. If I haven't got a fluff on the end, that palette's been sitting open like that, and it's got still hair in it. Supposed to be a, maybe I should get my wibbly wobbly brush out. You can't see what I'm doing. Holbein's bright pink. I will. Tr I will. I will get some. <laughs> I just spent a fortune on. Um, like a acrylic -y paint and that. I keep thinking, oh, I don't need any more watercolours. I've got tons and tons of them. <laughs> and they're like, they last so long as well. It's just like, it's a bit ridiculous. I'm trying to um, declutter. <laughs> trying to declutter. I'm going through like little cupboards at a time. I'm finding some strange things. 
Oh yeah, please, man, you do. When I, I look on the um, website, I don't like how the bleach has done that to that because then it doesn't look right. So I'm just going over it. Let's go over that bit. That's it. I like this one. It's really pale and loose and nice and pretty. And let's try another one. <laughs> Well, let's try a. I'll try another one in a minute. That's what I'll do next. Some. Um, I was just doing some grasses. Let's do some green, greeny grass. <laughs> I can't show you my wall. I suppose I could. <laughs> to show you everything that's up on the wall behind me. You have to excuse the wibble wobbling. It's like cameras on the move, so be warned. <laughs> Just taking it out the I don't I don't know if this is gonna work. So it might go upside down and around the wrong way. Oh, look, you can see my pajamas. Hello. <laughs> look at my wall. Can you see my wall? Oh it's upside down. Oh yeah, as this is just to make me feel sick. It's full of full of flowers. I don't know what I'm looking at. There you go. Oh. <laughs> now I've forgotten which way you've got to go on back on the camera. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> that was weird. I do like the op opera, opera. Pink, that bright opera pink by um, is it Mission? <laughs> but the thing is, when I scan my paintings, like if I want to turn a painting into a fabric design, the, the pink, is, um, my scanner has trouble picking up the luminous colors. Baby canaries must be tiny. Yeah, they, they are canaries, aren't they, Minnie? I forget. Let's do some wispy grass. I'm gonna, maybe I should get my... Um, yeah. Mr. Flippy Floppy's coming to make some wispy grass. I can't talk. Wispy grass. <laughs> this is a... Everyone always asks me about this brush. This is called a sword brush. I call it a flippy floppy brush because it means you haven't got much control. It's really flippy floppy. And it's a medium and it's by Artmaster three series three thousand. It sounds like um it should be like a Harry Potter broom or something. <laughs> you know what I mean? Well the ne Nemus, what is the Harry Potter um oh, see it, it drops. It holds a lot of paint, but you can get some nice lines that that I just I just hold it at the end and you can just get some like grassy leaves. You can get really thin lines and thick lines and you don't have much control. See so it's all a bit unexpected. I'm trying to like do some grassy ends. <laughs> Does that make sense? Yeah. I've decided I make up words and have my own language. Nimbus 2000, yeah, well, this is an Artmaster Series 3000. <laughs> Which I think is quite funny. Shall I try painting a flower with it? Hi, Margie! <laughs> Summer colours, well, that, that's summery, isn't it? This one, look, I just really love. I'm gonna to just show you a close up of this one because, um, look how pretty it is. I just love pink and orange together, there's something about it pink, orange, and green. They're like summer colours, aren't they? <laughs> I think I got like some of this, um, opera pink by, um, it's by. What was it? Mission. Yeah. The opera, bright opera. And this is it. Look how bright that is. And when I scan this in, and try and um, get it to 
it won't it come out as a like a weird color <laughs> and i think that happens with most light luminous colors when you try and scan them or day glow is not luminous is that it doesn't pick up that intensity but anyway oh this is weird doing it with this brush yeah. <laughs> give it a stem <gasps> Blocked a blob. Never mind. Tissue is here. It's all right. <laughs> Let's go over it again. No panic. Thank you, Margie. Practice. <laughs> well, I don't know. I always say, oh, yeah, practice, anyone could do it. But sometimes it's like me trying to play the guitar. Oh, I need to swap brushes. I need to do flat leaves. <laughs> That's not happening. Um, I always say to people, oh, yeah, you, of, course, of course you can do, um, you can paint. You can do watercolours. It's easy. Everything, blah, 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 blah. Everyone can do it, you just got to practice. But I don't think it is just practice, actually. From, <laughs> because I've practiced playing the guitar. I can't do it. So I think it's a mixture of practicing and talent <laughs> that you have to have. I'm going to use this nice sort of grey colour again to do something. Now I have run out of space. I'm, trying, I'm keeping all these separate because what I do, I, I scan them in, separate them from the background. You've seen my process. It's a lot. And, um, and then turn them into a fabric design. So I'm just going to get another. So over the morning, I've decided that I'm going to paint paintings that I can turn into fabric designs. Sometimes I'll do one that are like a finished painting I'll sell but um, yeah <laughs> yeah language is a hard Lisa I think um, my friend Nuno he, he speaks like five languages and it's easy to pick up it's just like he's like he can play guitar paint he does like everything which is sick <laughs> Uh, I learned French for like three years and I can understand bits of it, but um, I did it as part of, of my like textile degree. And, but um, I still, I still can't speak it. I think it's like having the confidence to speak it as well, which I'm very confident about. So this is a, um, what do you call it? And Queen Anne's lace thing, <laughs> sort of, or cow parsley, or something like that. That sort of thing. Yeah, I always used to think that, like, now it's just practice. Everyone can do anything. But I've decided at the grand old age of fifty-two that um, no, actually. <laughs> But then, then again, when I say practice, was it to be a master at something, someone's or whatever, you have to have 10,000 hours of, of doing that. But I still don't think that works. <laughs> it's like I've been trying to practice the guitar for more than 10,000 hours and I still can't do it. <laughs> My son picks it up quite easy, he like teaches himself bit sickening really. <laughs> My eldest daughter can like play the guitar and things. Me, not a musical bone in my body. Things are like <laughs> Morning Sue <laughs> Nice to see you. <laughs> yeah well, I haven't been here that much. To be perfectly honest. <laughs> 
<laughs> I've just got back into it, so um, that's probably why I've had, I had some time time off, <laughs> so to say. But I've missed doing it. Oh, and my life is like more settled now, so um, I feel more um. What's the word? Yeah, settled to do things again. <laughs> these I'm not sure what these are. These are just made up flowers I'm doing. Can't be a bit bit of made up flower. Just dropping some um pink in with the purple colour. I'm not sure what that purple colour is actually. It's a mission purple from the, the mission <laughs> side and a bit of opera pink in there bright opera by mission squidge it all in pinky purples That one's got a long stem. I always do the stems too short and then I have to um, like paint extras in. <laughs> it's not always good. Let's do like a delphinium. So I've got some really nice blue here, which is calling out to me. Delphiniums. Which is, is a bit sort of like that, how I paint them. They have like wispy bits coming out. This probably doesn't make a bit much sense there. Don't you think, oh my God, what's she painting? It's just <laughs> blobs. Yeah, it is blobs. <laughs> That's how I paint in my poppy glass. I show you how to paint blobs. Nice blobs, eh? Got some really dark, like inky blue here. I like the um, mission. Is it indigo? which is that colour, which I forget. When I pull out my different palettes I've got, you've seen my palettes, I've got like loads. Um, I forget that, oh, that, oh yeah, I used to like that colour and I haven't got it on my other palette. So it sort of um, makes things a bit more exciting. <laughs> really? Everyone's going to find that exciting? But look. <laughs> no, I haven't finished the Winnie Pooh book yet, Lisa. I'm such a slacker. I went off it. <laughs> you just reminded me about it. I was going to do it for my granddaughter's such a bad Mima. She calls me Mima. But she doesn't know. I don't, she'll get it one day when I've finished. I want to go look at it now. <laughs> I'll finish this and then I'll go and get it. I think I know where it is. You can have a, have a peek. Do they all look nice together? Yeah, might need some more, um, I don't know, little flowers. <laughs> Let's do some little pink and blue things around just that don't really make much sense. Just blobs and then just have fun. I have fun with these. I just drop extra colours in. Just think, yeah, it's got five petals. It's a flower or four petals. <laughs> That's got a horrible grey colour. Grey. That's it. These blobs are flowers, as you can see. <laughs> this is really give them middles, just like this. And then they get all splodgy, and then you can get a bit of 
tissue. Morning, Jake. <laughs> you find your excitement wherever you can. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> that was up to read. There we go. I'm going to get my mini poo. Where are you? All right, let's just spend the last five minutes having a look at this. See, right there, that's that. That would do. I'm just going to put it over to one side to dry. When you go, let's see how far I got. Eh? Move that. I don't want to get paint on it. She says this is like the paint on the worktop. <laughs> Yeah, this is still my favourite. <laughs> and these they were splodges, weren't they? I made them into spiders. <laughs> I, don't, I think I might have to do one tomorrow, actually. Yeah, I, I forgot what ink I was using to. So that's nice ink. <laughs> and eat all. <laughs> Piglet. I did get quite far, didn't I? He bounced me. I like that one. <laughs> Poo floating away. Yeah, I'm going to have to find my poo book. I don't know where I've put it, actually. <laughs> and then do, do one. I think I'll do one tomorrow morning. I'll do a poo. I like these round ones. Oh, I miss doing them actually. <laughs> I was going to fill this all up, but um, I'm not sure. <laughs> of course, I can do it. When you know when you start something, and you think you can't do it. <laughs> I sure she'll love it. She'll love it now. Well, I don't know. I think I might have to give it to her when she's older. She'll probably get her crayons out and scribble. <laughs> yeah. So with all the mistakes and everything, it's nice, isn't it? I forget how nice it is. I looked at it for a while. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> so that's, doing, that's my life. <laughs> I mean, everything was running on nicely and then suddenly something goes... <laughs> Yeah, give it to her 21st. God, that's so, yeah. God, I'll be old. <laughs> She'll probably still scribble in it then. She likes painting. <laughs> oh, I'm looking through it again. I do like this. I like being stuck up a tree. That's how I feel at the moment, like a fat poo stuck in a hole. No, that sounds wrong. <laughs> I've got Chardonnay tummy. I'm drinking too much wine. <laughs> yeah, anyway, thank you for joining me, guys. <laughs> um, I'll put these back quickly. They're still not dry because they're really wet. But that one's really nice. Look, the pretty colours. Pretty, pretty. And then these, these there, and then my blobs and things. But look closely. Because you wanted to, didn't you? Got no choice. <laughs> oh, thank you, Rosalie. Good. Thank you for joining me. I'm going now. <laughs> that was a quick one for a Monday. <laughs> Tomorrow I'll do I'll do a poo. Well, I'll do a um a Winnie the Pooh in my in my book because I've got to keep it going. You know, otherwise, I'll just sit there and I won't do anything. All right, take care, everybody, and I'm gonna sort my nails out. So I'll see you. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.